And the reality is, if you don't have good colon health, it's impossible to attain the proper overall health that you're looking for. But look at some of the before and after pictures. And in fairness to Dr. Shinya, he does recommend some dietary changes, but he also talks about drinking four to five liters of Kangen water every single day. Here's some more footage. This is a picture of a 45-year-old female chronic constipation along with breast cancer. But again, just look at the before and look at the after. And I apologize, I realize that this footage is graphic, but guys, it is a reality that we have to pay attention to. Now, speaking of sores, here's another picture. Just look at the before, look at the before and look at the after only three months after treatment. Now. I don't think this guy needs an introduction. Late night TV, especially, we see him all over the country. Kevin Trudeau, he wrote two phenomenal books. One is called Natural Cures That They Don't Want You To Know About. But on page 77 in this book, he talks about when your body pH is alkaline, no illness, no disease. I want to repeat, when your body pH is alkaline, no illness, no disease. He goes on to further say that every single person that has cancer has a pH that's too acidic. And so, what we're going to talk about now is the technology itself. This technology, at the touch of a button, can take ordinary tap water and can make five different grades of water, each of the waters having their own uses and applications, if you will. And you'll find that this water actually varies in pH from 2.5 to 5.5 to 9.5, all the way to 11.5, which actually brings me up to the next uh, next part of our presentation, and that's to, for you to get introduced to the star of today's show, and it's certainly not me, it's the technology itself. So what we're gonna do right now is we're gonna actually move on over into, a, into the kitchen where we're gonna actually be able to take uh, you know, take a live demonstration and show you right before your own eyes what some of the interesting properties of this water is, and then we're gonna break down the machine itself so you can get an idea how it does what it does. Thank you. All right, what I'd like to do right now is introduce you to the star of today's presentation. And, and as I talked about, it's not me, it's this actual machine itself that Enagic makes. And what we're looking at here is the SD501. And let me just take a moment here to explain to you how it is that this technology actually works. And then I'm gonna take you through a demonstration very similar to the one I saw nine months ago so you can actually see with your very own eyes what it is that this water has to offer in terms of benefits for you and your family. Now, what I'd like to do is first of all, take you through the process. You see what happens is what we're gonna do is we're gonna take ordinary tap water, your ordinary tap water that you have an unlimited supply of and we're gonna push that tap water through this white hose. And the first thing that's gonna actually take place is the water itself, your tap water, is going to get filtered. As the water travels through this filter right here, we're gonna remove all the impurities, the rust, the leads, the chlorines, and all the impurities in the water, and what remains behind are the minerals the calciums, the magnesiums, the sodiums, potassiums. And as we all know, first of all, our body needs the minerals. As a matter of fact, our body needs minerals more so than vitamins, but we also need those minerals for this next stage to occur. You see, behind this filter are a set of seven massive electrolysis plates, and it's these plates that actually create the magic to the water, if you will. As a matter of fact, what I'm holding in my hand is a set of those seven electrolysis plates. And think of this as the engine. This is what's actually driving this technology. And the secret to the grade of water is as the water travels across these electrode plates, what it's going to do. Because through a process called electrolysis, we're going to take an average water molecule and we're going to split it into a negative ion and a positive ion. Now the negative ion water is what the Japanese refer to as Kangen water, and that's the water that we're going to drink. And the Kangen water is actually going to travel through the top of this device here. Now simultaneously, that positive ion water is going to actually travel through this secondary hose and we're going to talk about what kind of water comes out of that here in just a second. Now, as you initially start to drink this water, we don't want to shock our bodies with too much alkalinity and as a result of that, you're going to actually start with 8.5. 
8.5. As you just heard, there's a built-in microprocessor that's going to tell you all along the way what kind of water it is that this device is making. So when you initially start, we're going to start with 8.5 or 8.5 alkaline water for the first two weeks. From that, we're going to go to... Kangen water 9.0. Kangen water 9.0. And here we want to stay for another two weeks. And then after about 30 days, this is whereabouts you want to stay at. Kangen water 9.5. Kangen water 9.5. And so again, for the first couple weeks, we're going to start at 8.5. We're going to ease our way into this alkalinity and then go to 9. And then after 30 days, we're going to stay at 9.5. And this is the water that we want to drink and saturate our bodies with. Now, when you press this button here, clean water. Now, as you hear, the device is telling you that we're making clean water. Now, this is water that's actually been filtered, except it's not been electrolyzed. And the reason you'd want to use that water is on two separate scenarios. First of all, if you've got babies at home, I mean, when the babies were born, God made them perfect. They don't need any more alkalinity. So as a result of that, if you were to mix, say, a baby formula, you would do it with the clean water. Also, if you've got somebody that's taking medications at home, because of the solvency properties of this water and the microclustering technology, you'd want to take your medications with clean water. You wait about 30 to 45 minutes, and then you can have as much of the Kangen water as your little old heart desires. And I'm going to actually take you through a demonstration with some tea here in a few minutes so you'll get an idea as to why that is the case. Now, when you press this yellow button down here, this water carries with it a pH of 5.5. Beauty water. The Japanese call this beauty water or sansei water, and water that has a pH of 5.5 is absolutely awesome for your skin and for your hair. As a matter of fact, most ladies buy something called toner at $20, $30, $50 a bottle, and the purpose of toner is to bring your skin's pH back to that balance, and here with this device here, you can take ordinary tap water and make an unlimited supply of it, and again, this water is absolutely awesome for your skin and for your hair. Now, when you press this button down here, Strong acidic water. 